Hey, what's going on guys? Real quick, Miss Italian here. Before the video begins, just want to let you guys know, we do indeed have Marauder's Apparel on sale. In the description down below is the link to pick up your Marauder's gear. It is on sale all season long for the WBE. If you want to pick it up, feel free to do so. If not, thank you for listening and enjoy the video. Welcome back everyone, Miss Italian here. Coach! Hold on, hold on. Coach! Of your New York Marauders. Today we're going up against Crimson Seabed, aka Chase, the coach of the Detroit Steel Wings. A solid man, a solid scene that we're scared of, and a solid game to come your way. Now, Chase in the Crimson City right now, or the Detroit Steel Wings, are 2 and 3. We are 3 and 2. We're trying to avoid that 3 3 5 hondo. He's trying to get the 5 hondo. So our goal is to get a W this week and try to uh, go 4 and 2 and be sitting pretty. At the six week mark, of course, our squad is right over here, ready for action. We have a hunk of chunk of Mega Agron, and then we do also have Chase and his Mega Lad. It's gonna be very hard to get through, but that's our squad. We are ready for action. Quick shout out to the Lord Envy himself for helping me build this team. And by helping me, I mean basically doing it all for me, along with Tia, my girl. They sat there, made the team, I play tested it, and then that was that. And of course, Shout out to my man Kyle for getting me the team because my dates are still in Connecticut and getting a monitor elite play is a little, a little uh, rough. So shout out to you, uh, to my man Kyle. Link to all that stuff in the description down below. And then, real quick, the skimmer guys, three of these six mods are in German and they have badass names. So get ready for that. Chase is over here rocking out with a lovely Megaladius, Scolipede, uh, Skarmory, Umbreon, Primarina, and a Raichu. A very solid team. A team that's going to be pretty hard to get through. Uh, Lead-wise, I don't know if I go Mega Aggron. Mega Aggron says actually, I, you know what? No, Mega Aggron is a great idea. Unless you go Primarina. I, I, I don't know what happens here, actually. Do you go Primarina? I could go Embor and just scare the hell out of Primarina and the um, Skarmory. I could definitely do that. Let me get my damage calculator before, before I forget. Let me do that. Damage calculator right there. Put it in singles mode and not doubles. There we go. All right. So that is that. I'm going to look extra pasty and white because of the glare on my face. Minimize that real quick. Um, I think I'm just going to play it safe and go with Starlos, the powerful Mega Agron. I think I'm going to do that right now. Uh, I don't want because even Raichu is a big threat as well. Specs Raichu could be a thing. Uh, I think I'm just gonna go with the leading so important right now, man. It's so important. So I'm trying to do that. That's a squad. We are ready for Week Six of the WBE Marauders Steel Wings going at it. Week Six. Here we go. Chase. Good luck to you, my man. You already, you already said that in the chat, but. Good luck to you. Here we go, my friends. Marauders want this W, of course. Chase does as well. But we, 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 I want to go. I, I need to go 4-2, man. I can't be, I can't be, uh, going 3-3. Three, three. I can't have that. I need to stay in play position, man. Stolos leads the pack. A.K.A. our Klungo. Panzeron. Skarmory. All right, do we trade rocks or do I go for something else? Who does rocks hurt more? My team doesn't really care about rocks too much. I kind of want to get chip damage on Scolipede. On everybody, honestly. Uh, I did get my Mega Ring, guys. I did get it, so we're good to go now. The Mega Ring is there. We're golden. I can either go for Roar, or we can just trade Stealth Rocks. And I think trading Stealth Rocks is the best option, so let's just do that. Trade Rocks. I'll Mega Evolve. I'll trade Rocks, turn one. And that will be that, my friends. What other choice do we really have? Trade. I could go for Roar there. No reason to get a Zesty with Iron Head or Earthquake. You saw my team builder. You saw what they do. He goes to that taunt. Very nice. Okay. That's pretty solid right there, honestly. Very good play on Chase's part. Good tournament for him. Taunt Skarmory is good. Uh, now you're going to Hydreigon or Embor. I'm scared of the Brave Bird. So I might just go... I don't want to reveal a physical Hydreigon yet, though. I really don't. No way, Jose. I'll go uh, Zerkatry here. I have Hidden Power, Water, Signal Beam, and T-Bolt. Ain't going to do Jack against that uh, Raichu. So I'm going to bring in Zerkachu here, try to force him to the Raichu, and then I'm going to double switch into our, like, Agron, and then try to put him to work. I mean, our, our uh, Hydreigon. Zerk comes in, though. Spikes go up. Mm, that was a good taunt turn one, man. That was a very good taunt turn one. Uh, I'm just going to switch out here as you're definitely going to bring... Do I have Defog and Finny? No, I do not. I have no way to get rid of the heads this week. That's going to be a pain in the ass dealing with those spikes. Um, All right, let's just bring in our... Uh, 
Um, I don't think he has any favors in the Raichu. Raichu's definitely going to come in here. I'm not going to tail go anything crazy. Actually, I could tail go and go for plus three. I really could just go tail glow here. She's so definitely not gonna outspeed me. So if I get plus three on this thing, what can Raichu do to Zerk? Let me see real quick. Can I hit a power water Oko at plus three? Zerkatry up against Raichu the has lightning rod, to be honest. Um Not a Lola. Not a Lola Raichu, regular Raichu. Get this out of here. Uh, right to default. You really can't do much to me at all. Let's see. Hidden Power of Water at plus three. That's speed. What the heck am I doing? Uh, at plus three. Does indeed kill. And he can't do much to me. I kind of just want to go for it. Do I go for it this early, though? I'm, you know what? I'm just going to go for it. See what happens, man. We're going to see the, uh, uh, what do you call it coming? The, the Raichu. There it is. All right. Hidden Power Water does indeed. Oh, cost this is modest. I'm timid. Ooh, I forgot about that. Mm, that might be a little bit of misplay. Might be a little bit of misplay. It's all right. We're at plus three. Still, it still has a 63% chance to Oko. And what does Raichu do to me? It doesn't do much with his attacks right here. I don't see anything scammer besides me. Would you go fake out? Would you go fake out? Hmm. Let me see if Sigma Beam does more. Uh, this is Hidden Power of Water. Same thing, same damage with Ice, so I didn't really bother changing that. Let's make this Signal Beam. I should do a little bit more, actually. Signal Beam is a guaranteed Oko. Alright. We're going Signal Beam, my friends. We're just gonna go for it. T-Bolt goes off. Should do about 25%. Not even because we got some bulk in us. Signal Beam goes off. Right, you going down and out. I've just sashed. Are you an AV Raichu then? Holy crap! Mm. Alright, so I was lied to about that signal beam. This is some kind of bulky Raichu. He didn't do much to me at all right there. Oh, uh, he's, gonna, he's gonna go T-Bolt again, but he's gonna kill the Raichu, I think. And then you bring in, like, Scolipede? Probably, because I got Chuckaberry on deck for the EQ, so... We'll deal with that. Let's just go for a... I don't even need Hidden Power Water right now. There's no Ride on here at all. Uh, Signal Beam is good against the Umbreon. Good against Latius. Crappy against Primarina. But I outspeed it. So I'm just going to go Signal Beam again. Tiba goes off. I go down to uh, 94. 90. I'm exactly at half. That stinks. That's all right. So we got two average rolls. He got two 25s. He didn't get a 29 or a 20. We got the, yeah, he got average roll. It's fine. So Raichu is down and out right off the bat. Is that what I want? I don't know my plus four now. And you're definitely not going to bring in, like, you're going to bring in Scolipede with EQ, I think. So let's go with the Scolipede. And let's just see what EQ would do to me when I have a Shuckaberry on deck. Shuckaberry. Ooh, there's a chance. But I have HP investment in my Zerk. Let me just see how much I forgot. Honestly, forgot how much I had in it. Uh, Zerk has 180 HP. So that's Scolipede. Yeah, I live 38 to 45%, assuming you're adamant. Scolipede is here. And I think a plus 4 T-Bolt kills him. So we'll just go for T-Bolt here. Is he Sash, though? Who knows? Let's just go with T-Bolt. What other choice do I got? Here we go, guys! Earthquake! Shuckleberry! Three HP we had just enough, my friends. That was life orb indeed as well. Tebow goes off. That is the end of Kachow. Kachow is gone, my friends. Two big chaos to Zerk right off the bat. We are up six to four. But we're gonna lose our plus five Zerk right now. Our job was done. Alright, so with that life orb, we see that roll, roll was. Oh, that was such a Oh man. Oh man. He had to be jolly not adamant though. I would have died no matter if we, were, if we were adamant. Yeah, Jolly does 45 to 53. Just got an average roll. Didn't get a high roll or anything. You are in here with this uh, Latius. Did you at speed me? I don't even know, man. I was even going to stand and go for a signal beam because I died a spike. So let's find out right now. If I outspeed you, uh, you're going to die to a plus 5 signal beam, I'd say. Maybe not actually, but regardless, my play is signal beam all day, every day. All day, every day. We are up 6 to 4 right now. 
And honestly, if I outspeed you, I'll be the happiest guy alive. If not... Alright, there it is. You got like 110 base speed. If you're uninvested, I could outspeed you, I think. Let's see. I'm pretty sure you outspeed, but let me just see it right now. Uh, yeah. T-Ball goes off. That's the end of Zerk. He outspeed me, unfortunately. But that's alright. Goodbye, Mr. Zerk. Goodbye, Mr. Zerk. Ooh, okay. Jay, would you, we would just say maybe we were in full speed. So you definitely have some speed there. Because my Zerka tree has uh, 76 speed in him. And he's timid. So there was a chance for me to outspeed you. Like if he had, actually, was there a chance for me to outspeed you? There wasn't, actually. So I had to make that play there. Um, I'm going to take spike damage. I do have Scarf Buzzwell ready for action. Uh, he could easily kill with a, po not a poison. You have a leech life, maybe. I could also bring in Hydreigon because you have T-Bolt, and that's all we know so far as the T-Bolt. You definitely have a Dragon move as well for my uh, for my Hydreigon. Um, let's see what Buzzle does here. Buzzle, Buzzle is just max attack, max speed, right? That's what my Buzzle is. All right. Oh, 102 speed. So yeah. Uh, we are. What nature are we? Okay, we're adamant. Ladius will die to the... He might not, actually. I don't know what kind of bulk he has. Assuming you have max speed. You definitely don't have max speed. You gotta have some bulk in there. You gotta have some kind of bulk in there. Uh, You have T-Bolt for Finny. I want to bring in Hydreigon so bad. I mean, Buzzle so bad. But I don't think I don't think it's gonna kill you. I don't think is gonna kill you. I don't think it does... So I think give me some kind of bulk. Give me some kind of bulk. I have eight seconds. I'll bring a buzzle. I'm running out of time. I gotta bring a buzzle here. There's a chance to kill. Huge chance to kill right now. Uh, I take the spike damage. Oh, do I want to lose buzzle though? He's so good against Umbreon. He's so good against Umbreon. I'm scarfed. I'm going leech life. If I, it's gonna do 95 at most to you, 95% at most. Assuming you're max HP, max defense, bold. Might even do less. All right, I'm gonna bam the psychic. I'm gonna bring in Hydreigon here. Bam to the psychic. I'll bring Hydreigon here. That was, I, was I, I don't want to risk it. I, 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 I'm thinking, I'm second guessing that now. I'm gonna bring Hydreigon and bait into the Psychic or the Psy Shock. There it is. All right, good. Now we're just gonna go for Crunch. Let's see how much Hydreigon Crunch does, man. We got a physical Hydreigon. This thing is insane this week. All right. Uh, doesn't even matter. We're just gonna go Crunch here. Uh, I, I just want to see what your stuff is. I'll go Crunch here. I'll go Crunch here. I want to make sure I damage you down so then Buzzle can kill you. I panicked. I definitely did panic there. I definitely panicked a little bit there. So I think we're okay with this right now. Um, yeah, he's going to withdraw. He's going to receive his physical set now. Panzerong comes back. It's going to be the Skarmory. Catching a crunch. All right, now we are Hydreigon. I don't know what thing that was. Adamant. Max attack. That's a decent damage. I wonder what your Thunderfang would do now. Let's see here, guys. Thunderfang. According to this, does uh That's a lot. That's my bad. I'm looking at way like 9%. What the heck? Where is what's his face? Um Skarmory, 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 Skarmory. I mean there's nothing. Assuming you're full defense. Absolutely nothing. But that crunch did like. Let's see here. Crunch did. Yeah, so I thought there's a little bit more. Just a little bit more. I have Psych MZ. I'm just gonna go Thunder Fang and Roost up on you. I'm gonna go Thunder Fang here, get some damage on you. Why not? Thunder Fang goes off! One more, you might be gone. And we also might, uh, Rocky Helmet! 
He's got Rue Spikes. Oh, man. He's just pure steel type right now. Oh, this thing's a pain in the ass. This thing is a pain in the ass. All right. I'm going to roost up here, too, as you go for, like, spikes or your own... Maybe you go whirlwind here, too. Oh, I wish I had a bulk upset now instead of the roost up all day on you. But you might have a whirlwind, so I don't know. I don't know, man. This is tough. This is a tough one. We're up 6-5. Got to kill... Ugh, so many things we got to kill still. Let's see. Do you have whirlwind? No. Go, I love if you want whirlwinds here. Go whirlwinds. Go whirlwinds. I have Embor on deck for you whenever I need it, but... You roost again. All right. We both roost it up. We both roost it up. You have Primarina, Umbreon, Skarmory, and Latius left. <sighs> hmm. Should I go for defense drop? Should I just bring an Embo? What do I do here? Bringing an Embo is so obvious, so I'm just going to do it. If he goes Brave Bird and reads it, so be it. I don't know what the choice I have here. I'm not going to sit here all day. I'll, bring, I'll, make, I'll be the aggressor of this game. Bring an Embo. He's ready for action. Flamberex! Spikes. Oh, we got two loads of spikes. All right. Wild Charge just makes everything right now. So I might just go for that. I'm expert belted. Uh, I'm expert belted? I think I am. What am I? Yes. If I go Wild Charge, hit everything. If I go Flare, let's hit this. Umbreon. I think I'm going to bring in Ladius here. I'm gonna try to catch Lattice with the uh, with the uh, with the with the Hydreigon. I'm bringing, I'm bringing Hydreigon back in. I know it took spike damage there. I don't want to go Flare Blitz here. I could go Wild Charge. I'll put you base, best worst case scenario. You bring an Umbreon. I don't think you want to do that though, because the Flare Blitz is gonna definitely two shot that thing. Still, I feel because you're gonna assume I'm. Not, I, you don't know what item is. You're gonna assume choice being the Life Orb. I think and it's gonna do that's gonna do well over half the Umbreon. I can calculate right now for proof. I right, to reassure myself that he's not going to bring in the Umbreon here, but... I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. Let me see. Umbreon. I it's like a default physical Umbreon. So you're faster than me. Wow, it's good to know. He is speeding that thing. You're faster than you switch first. And we do catch Latias. Beautiful. All right, nice. We get a free crunch here, or I don't know what... So you can bring an Umbreon easily right now. Uh, cause you know I have Crunch, you know everything the thing. I'll play. I'm gonna slow it down. I'm gonna go for Crunchy. I'm gonna slow it down a bit. I'm gonna slow it down a bit. I'm glad I did. Wow. That just takes me out. Wow. I didn't expect that at all. That was literally the last thing I wanted to see there. How much does a T-Bolt do to my Finny now? That was honestly insane. Alright, let me see. Top of Finny. Lattice. I did not think that would kill me, man. I know it's stabbing everything, but I have some bulk in the Hydra gun. Alright, uh, Ladius, Mega Ladius up against, uh, Tapu Finny. I have 188 HP in this bad boy. And not much of a death at all, to be honest. Alright. Let's see here. He has T Bolts. Oh man, guys, I didn't ask for that at all. Does well over half. My move is threatening him pretty badly, too. Uh, come up and then plus spikes. I don't even know if I can risk going to the Finny right now. I think I have to. What other choice do I have? I could sucker punch you, but I need to save Embor, so I'm just gonna do this. Bring in the Finny to the spike damage. Terrain goes up. That is one powerful Mega Lad. It's probably modest too. Time enough, I can take two shots. I don't know, man. I don't know. I'll go for that Moon Blast so Buzzer could kill later on, but this is not good, man. This is not good. T-Block goes off. Uh, 
Good amount of damage there, like I said. Very good amount of damage. Moonblast goes off. Put you in that range to die to the uh, leech life now. Hmm. Do I need... I'd rather lose M... But I know I need, I need Ember for the Skarmory. Skarmory outspeed the Tooch is really bad, but I don't think he has any attacks. I think I gotta let Finny drop here, man. This is not looking good. This Megalass is putting in the work right now. Finny's gotta drop. Bring in the Buzz Wall, just Leech Life everything. But he's Scarf, and I'm gonna be locked into the Leech Life against a Primarina. Or a Skarmory. Oh man, guys, I don't know. T Bolt, Dragon Pulse. That's all we got. And Psychic, that's all we got. I mean, Aggron resists them all, but I'm not, it's gonna like three shot Aggron, I feel. Let me see Mega Aggron over here. Agron, Mega. Ooh, he actually will live. But I need to save him. <sighs> yeah. Let's just go for Finny Moonblast here. Gotta sack off the Finny, man. Gotta sack him off. Goodbye, Finny. This thing is so powerful. I did not think Hydreigon would die. I did not think that would happen at all. Alright, we'll bring in the Buzzwole. Is there anything Sif I could go for? Can't even go Poison Jab, man. Like, because you have a, you have a Skarmory. Do I go? Do I hope the Scarf? He takes the Scarf bait. Do I hope he does that? Or do I bring an Aggron and just like deal with it? I think I'm just gonna bring an Aggron here, guys. I don't want, I don't want the Buzzwool. Buzzwool is so unsafe right now. I'll bring an Aggron. Oh man, oh man, oh man. He's a lot of spadef in him too. So like Yo yeah, bring an aggron here. I'm like nervous though man, like You die to the iron head. I gotta go Iron Head. I'm just gonna do it. If you bring in like Skarmory, I'm not gonna risk anything else. You do withdraw. Here comes Skarmory, correct? Yeah. Things a pain in the ass, man. Things a pain in the ass. I don't want to reveal Scarf yet. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. That Rocky Hummer, man. Oh, I can't get through the Skarmory. And if he taunts me, it's like a wrap. Uh, I'll go Iron Head again, try to try to get some damage on it. He goes to the Bruce. I almost went EQ, dude. I almost went EQ. Almost went EQ. He's just pure steel type now. Iron Head goes off again. I wish I went EQ there. I wish I went EQ there. I don't know, man. I think we're losing this game. I think we're losing this game. I can't get to that Mega Latius, dude. I guess I should've just gone at the Buzzwole and risked it, and then I could've brought an Aggro and switched it out, and be in this situation again. I don't know, man. This is not good. I'm gonna go with Stealth Rocks now. Just see what happens. He goes Roost, alright. I'll get the Rocks up again. Now the question is, do I try to get the EQ off? He's probably gonna defog here. But if he does, he gets rid of his, his spike, so that's fine by me. So I'm gonna go Iron Head again and try to bait him into a roost. See how it speeds me. There's that. I don't even know like what you do with the uh I could probably bring an Embor here too. Oh, I'm just wasting all Bagron's HP. I'm just wasting all of Agron's HP, and there's, uh, three of the spikes now, so I think I can go Roost. I'm gonna go EQ, try to catch the Roost. Alright, there it is. We catch it, and let's see how much EQ does to you. 
Should be a decent amount, I'd say. Should be a decent amount, I'd say. Not a lot, a lot, but better than nothing. Okay, good. Now we're going to force you to roost again as we bring in the Ember. Take so much spike damage. Oh, but Ember's going to come in here. We'll sack Aggro off to the Latias for a Buzzwell switch. It's going to be a close game, guys. It's going to go either way, so I'm in bad shape, though. I'm in really bad shape. Went to those Hydreigon. I did not think I would die with that Hydreigon, man. Did not think that at all. All right. Here comes uh, here comes our Ember. Take a lot of spike damage. There's that Roost. Now do I go Flare Blitz, Wild Charge? I 100% go Wild Charge here, I think. Let me just see. Ember. Max attack. We are expert belted. Up against Skarmory. Dude, Wild Charge is nothing. Wild Charge is literally nothing. I need a Flare Blitz. I need a Flare Blitz. Let me see how much Primaria takes from this. Probably nothing as well. Primaria take over half. Wild Charge would kill it. So it's a 50 50. Do I call Primaria coming in? Do I just go for Flare Blitz? What do I do here? I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna go Flare Blitz and play it safe. He goes to that Roost. And can Flare Blitz kill? According to the Calc, it does. According to the Calc, it does. Kill this thing is huge for me. Absolutely huge for me. Absolutely huge for me. Sturdy. Okay. So that's that. Now, does he roost or does he go for. I did get the burn. I didn't realize. I got the burn! Oh, man. I am so sorry, Chase. I didn't even realize that. I am so sorry for that burn, dude. That's going to make a huge difference now. There's no more mind games to worry about, really. Oh, I'm so sorry about that burn, Chase. I am so sorry about that burn. I am so sorry about that burn. That is insane. That's huge for me, but I'm so sorry about that burn, Chase. You have Umbreon, Primarina, and Latias left. Pretty sure Primarina outspeeds me. But I do have some speed in my Ambor. I don't know if you go Maxi Primarina, would you? Oh, man. This is going to be a close one. This is going to be a close one, my friends. This is going to be a close game right here. All right. Latias comes in. I go suck a punch here. Rock damage goes off. Let's see if he has Roost. Of course, it's like a punch here, but if you have Roost, it sucks, to, it sucks for me. Sucks for me, man. It really sucks for me. There it is. All right. I think, I think that concludes the game. I think Chase has it now. So even if I had gone for an attack there, it wouldn't have really mattered much at all. Now the question is, do you double roost? Do you double roost? Do you double roost? Do you double roost? I'm going to take a punch again. He double roosted there. All right. I'm just going to keep going, like a punch. I need damage this thing so Buzzle could kill it. That's all I care about is Buzzle killing you. That's all I care about. I think I lose, though. I'll go second punch again. He's probably going to switch it out, actually. Nope. All right. Get some big damage there as we dropped it to a Psychic. We're bringing Buzzwall. We go Leech Life because we have to. Uh, and then I think we lose, guys. Chase played well. I think he's got it. I think he's got it fair and square. Buzzwall, your moment, man. If you kill Primarina, I could win, but if you don't, it's over. Alright. I'll go Leech Life here. What other choice do I have? Oh, if I just get my Aggron around over with the Ember earlier, could I have an Umbreon switch in or something? Alright, we killed the we killed the Delta here. Get our health back. Scarf Buzzle is gonna do this for us. We got plus one at sack. And Primarina comes in here every time. So I'm just going to Buzzwall Poison to do the Primarina. Can it Oko? 
Buzzwall, Primarina, Poise Jab, Kanad Oko. That's it. He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. And a plus one leech life does like nothing. So he's got it. Fair and square. That sucks. But well done to Chase though. Well done to Chase. We're gonna be three and three, guys. That's okay. I just I just mismanaged my M board and my Agron. That's my own fault. Cause I could bring an Agron here. I mean, there's gonna be rock damage going up, but like, I don't think it really matters. Here comes Primarina. Plus one, Poison uh, Leech Life does. Hmm. And I died a literally everything, so like. I, mean, I could bring an Aggron here, but it's not gonna matter. He's gonna get it 1 0, I think. I might be able to kill the market, I might be able to live one Moon Blast. Regardless, can't go Poison Jab due to the Choice Scarf, as you guys see there, so I gotta go Leech Life here. What other choice do I have? I hope for a crit or something, maybe I live, I, I don't even know. I'll be at full health here, let's see what happens. Oh man, you're physically bulky too, there's no way this is happening. Which means I might be able to live a Moon Blast if you don't have full investment. Might be able to get two off here, let's see. Let's see, Boswell, is there a chance? Do I have a little sliver? He's got it. Well done, Chase. He's gonna take it. He's gonna take it. He's gonna take it. He's gonna take it. I thought Hydra got enough bulk. I guess I mismatched that. It was a good game, though, I think. It wasn't the end of the world. So you're gonna take it with the spikes and everything. He's got a fair and square. He's gonna take it too well. Well done to Chase. And that's that, guys. Thank you for watching. As always, been telling you the glory sounds quite great. Then I will see you next time. Well done to Chase.